did you, go ahead baby go ahead did yeah. you ever send mm, vineyards tasting open we're just pulling in right now once at captivity no admission until space is available just like when you go to the restaurant in 600 feet make a u-turn if possible <laughs> On your right. All right, you guys. So this one is called, I think, Thatchered. I don't know where you go in. Oh, <laughs> we about to go in the vineyard. Every time we go somewhere, people are behind us. So tours, tastings, daily, eleven to five. Thatchered. Ain't no vines. No oh, grapes on them vines. Mm -mm, look at that dirt he kicking up. Slow down, sailor. Drinking early. We just gonna pull over and let you go. And that's Grandpa. <laughs> Lord, look here on his damn way. Out here getting damn tickets. The police gonna be here in a damn second. Hope it ain't no snake out here. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's so cold out here. Let's try the proper. Let's do this for y'all. The gram Facebook, YouTube. It's cold. It'll be better tomorrow. It's gonna be okay. Go ahead. 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 Go
it wasn't bad. We shared one. We didn't get to. So that was a good thing about that. And that's another thing about going to different wineries. You can go to many. That doesn't mean you're going to drink at all of them or you're going to drink all of your wine. So don't think because you go to six wineries that you're drinking at all of them. Some of them you may just be doing the scenery. Some of you may just take a sip. You just never know. Do you and do what you're, you know, you come there to do. But also, you want to be very, very responsible. Take turns, get an Uber, hire a driver, hire a company. Um, but yeah, that was really nice. So there is another one that's in the same driveway. Either you go straight there and you make a right to go to Thatch. So let's check them out. That's the name of it, Michael's Shop. Let's see what they're about. Hold on. Figure it out you guys because we're trying to figure it out on this dirty dirt <laughs> pothole what's this shop called I me mean, winery call oh, no, she I'm drove not. so fast y'all i couldn't even get the damn um name but we almost oh, there shit. We're already here. <laughs> yeah it's like a second up the street well and not even a second from what's it that is thatch thatch winery it's literally the same driveway so you pull in oh there's cars up here mm -hmm. Oh, look at this, this, this. Can, can your car, hold on. See, this is what, this, hold on. Is that delivery only? No, that's parking too. Can you get up there? Yep, we going. Oh my God, I'm keeping this on video. Don't go slow. <laughs> go, go, go. We can't drink anything though, we gotta leave. Yeah, but we can leave. Okay, so when we got out of the car, we just walked around. It wasn't a huge place, but it was cool that they were selling things under the tent and they had seats under the tent. Um, so yeah, it was a nice scenery to take some nice pictures. You see a lot of trucks coming up there. If I had my car, I don't even know. <laughs> to be honest, y'all. <laughs> It was real, like, real steep. So just be careful. That's back at Thatch. We came back down, and I just wanted to take a couple of pictures. But to be honest, it, it wasn't bad. I want to go back to Thatch, um, take some more time in Michael Shops. That was, was what that was. All right, so next we're going to head on to the spot that we had the picnic. Stay tuned if you want to know and see Even everything. with these dry-ass wines in Charlottesville, Virginia. If you a dry bitch, you going to love these wines in Charlottesville. You might find one sweet and it's going to be semi-sweet, semi-semi-semi.